Home free. Home free. Home free. Let go. Let go. That bit my tape. What you did, boy? Nigga in there doing push up. What I see, boy? No. No, I didn't Ray. That little Ray. Man, this ain't right. That little Ray. I ain't what the fuck, that man? Little Ray. Hey. That little Ray. That little Ray. I love you, boy. Hey, Ray got big as fuck, man. Hey, Ray cold on the field, hey, too. Yeah, he hey. Cold. Demon home, too, pussy. Demon home. Hey, cuz, are you still rapping? Got you. Nigga try to fuck me in. Nigga try to fuck me out. Yeah, yeah. Nigga try to fuck me in. Nigga try to fuck me out. Yeah, yeah. Fuck me in the pen. Tried to turn me out. I ain't. Welcome back to another episode of Big Six Bants. Of course, it's the game week 29 slash 30 roundup. Um, I don't really know what to say. It's just an interesting uh, day today. So first of all, we're going to make some adjustments. So I'm just going to pop that there. I'm going to pop that there. Um, Mandem, how are we doing today? How we wait, doing wait, today? wait. Wait, Mons, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm, I'm the only one that's won today. Well, this weekend, <laughs> there must be a top top row. We're just there so we're be. just so used to Tottenham fucking up. It's like it's it's just natural. You know what I'm I guess so. But regardless, I'm gonna need to be repositioned aside. I'm seeing a whole lot of drawers. <laughs> hey, what, what do you mean repositioned? Like I mean, like because like I mean, I'm not. Oh, oh, so. Well, well, no, no, Ethan deserves to be top over Patrick. Is that Patrick in the middle? Yeah, that's yeah, that's yeah, that's yeah, 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 yeah. Bring Patrick down. Bring Patrick down. I've got a, I've got a bow to pick with him. So bring it, bring him down. Oh wait, what, 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 what board man? Whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. You know, we can start off the intro, then we'll get into it, innit? Yeah, come on. Let me just run the intro. Listen, you lot, we're back for another episode of Big Six Bands. It is the mega panel today, of course. It's the Big Six Bands roundup as you guys love the most. It's already 100 people in the house, so make sure upon entry, you guys smash the like button and you subscribe to the channel. I'm obviously joined by Ethan. I'm joined by Corey. I'm joined by Kiers, Patrick. I'm also jo going to be joined by Kat a little bit later on. And of course, Traps is here as well. So listen, loads of, loads of different results today. Of course, Liverpool 2-1 against Brighton. Man City Arsenal 0-0. Spurs 2-1 as well. Um, they got the win against Luton Town and obviously Manchester United yesterday late kickoff with the 1-1 draw and the late dramatics in their game against Brentford away from home. I mean, there's a lot to talk about today. There's a lot to talk about. I mean, there's not really a lot to talk about about City and Arsenal's game because I'd rather watch paint dry. I could have got some sleep. I could have caught up on sleep. I sleep. Watch that piece of shit. The piece of shit I just saw. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, I don't know. Listen, big up everyone in the chat. There's so many people here already as well. As well. Big up Mr. Link. Big up Assad as well. He's, Assad says, uh, worst game of football I've seen in years. I actually yeah. want Liverpool to win the league now because at least they're entertaining. These two have played out yet another boring spectacle. Um, no, no, it was tactics. It was tactical. It was tactics. like two tacticians oh, yeah, going yeah, against each other. Nah, two nah, nah, going nah, against each nah, other. Um, big up Dre, Arsenal fan. He goes, It's Liverpool, it's in Liverpool's hands now. I don't want to see no running, right? All right, we'll get to that. Um, Liverpool, it's in oh, the, here's the always oh, in your hands talk now. Listen, it is in my hands, it is in my hands, but at least now, I, at least I can admit it, you know. Um, big up mm. Kizzy goes, I said, It's two great teams playing to win, not to lose. You wouldn't know about that anymore because you are out there going to burn the legend. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. Oh, crazy. Yeah, that's not crazy. I'm not crazy, fam. Top tier, fam. <laughs> I'm a top tier. But anyway, Mons, I'm going to need to be top. If you do it, I'll do it. It's one of the two, innit? <laughs> so... Well, at chat, who should be bottom? Is it because Arsenal are a point above City? So I'm guessing we'll have to move City yeah. to the bottom, bro. Simply because of that. I think that's I think that's kind of what it's going to have to be. Um, JJ, <laughs> Mr. Lloyd says 29% possession. Excuse me? Shameful. Was Wait, it? What? Was there was a 29%. Hey, let me go have a look at that. Don't worry, guys. I'll check. Yeah, let me, let me, dub, let me, let me double up. Let me, let me yeah, double I, up. I think there was, the point, there was a point in time Arsenal had like 26 even at the point in time in the game. Wait, let me, let me yeah, double check that. 28%. Oh, my God. I'm I said, wait. Yeah, we're going to get into this. Yeah, we're going to get into this game. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, what was I going to say? Partey. 
uh, Jaden missed their party. Looked five. Uh, party took five minutes to show why he's better than Declan Rice. Wow, wow, wow. Um, wow. You know, <laughs> Liverpool are winning the league. Whoever doesn't better become a believer ASAP. So listen, loads of comments. Big up football gospel as well. Montella energy today. Oh, listen, the way I got rushed last week, and I said. I'm going to be Brighton. You men are going to draw. I mean, going to go back to how things are. The, the, the reality, you know what I'm saying? Reality is going to be whatever I want. You know that one? Yeah, everyone playing with their beard hair and that. Now. Everyone's playing with their goatee and that. Everyone's playing with their goatee and that. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. I hear it now. Yeah. It's a funny wow. thing to say. Listen, oh, listen. Bro, it's not my boy, now. We'll, get to that. we'll get to that in my segment. You know what I'm saying? Um, kids, Patrick, Man City nil. Liverpool nil, the most boring game of the season with the most hype of the season, game of the season, but easily the worst spectacle of the season. But what I will say, it was a defensive masterclass, I'd say, from both sides. I'll give you guys that if you want me to give it any positive outlook. Um, thoughts, guys, thoughts. Let's open up the panel. <laughs> you know what? You know what, man? Uh, you're the first one, Mon. Man. You're the first one today who was saying uh, both sides masterclass. That there's a defense. Because according to some people and all the channels I, I've been jumping on, they're saying it's actually a Tata masterclass for keeping City away. It's quite funny that uh, I told people that if you want to win this title, I, I told Arsenal fans, if you want to win this trophy, you're going to have to come to City and punch us in the mouth and take us down. Because let me tell you something, Arsenal fans, you're focusing on the wrong opponent right now. <laughs> you're focusing on the wrong man. Because you're like saying, oh, City this, City that. But I'm just looking at Mons quietly going up the table. And now I'm doing calculations. I'm like, we have the harder runs right now. And Mons just took down Brighton, who's his bogey team. And mm. this man came to our stadium and had 26 positions. So there was a point in time, I don't even think they held the ball. And they called it a masterclass. Fair play, it's a masterclass because you kept Haaland quiet. But also Kai Havers did nothing. Fair play, it's a masterclass. That Foden was quiet. But Dosko Vario sat down Saka, your star boy, and now they're saying, oh, because he's injured. So, oh, the God. looking at this game, man, if I'm, if, if, I'm, if I'm... Let me be honest. I expected something like this, but I didn't expect it to be dead and bad like this. This was boring. I sat here at a point in time, boring. I was like... I, and it's bad for me to say this. I was like, ah, man, let me go outside and just stand by a tree, man. Because I was like, what the hell is going on? Because both teams... We're scared of each other. Both teams were waiting for the other team to make a mistake. Uh, both teams seem like none of them wanted to stand up. Is my is my audio good? It's a little, it's a little bit, um, a little bit of echoey feedback. Is that now. better? Is that better? Go on. Yeah, it's gone. Yeah, it's gone. It's, it was the charge. Yeah, gone. Yeah. All I was expecting is somebody from both teams to just stand up and say, "Let me take this game." De Bruyne was nowhere to be seen. Odegaard was working hard, but he was just flicking his hair. De Bruyne was just <laughs> arguing with other people. So, I don't know, man. I just If Arsenal fans are satisfied by that, it just shows that maybe you guys are not at that level yet. Because if I were That's an cool. Arsenal fan, I would be saying, I really had to go to City and slap them in the mouth to show that I'm king. As Pep said in the press, if you want to take our crown, you're going to have to take it from us. But you didn't today. You didn't. You got a draw. And some of you guys are breakdancing on your channels because of a draw. I don't know why. So that's all I'm great. That sounds so cute and that. I'll be real. That sounds cute. But at the end of the day, bro, <laughs> we sat here on a preview show not long ago, shows a couple of days ago, and you had so much chest. You said you were going to win the game today. That's what you said on this channel. But you didn't. So it's not... Forget about Arsenal coming to the A you had and trying to make, make sure we're kings and that. We don't need to do all that. We did, I told you, we didn't need to win this game today. And it do you, think, do you think you don't need to win this game? You think so? We, did, we don't. Because again, we haven't won today and we're still there. We're still two points behind Liverpool and above you. So City, are, we... City are just three points too, so they can just win one game and... No, so, no, that's what you want to happen. But you that's there's a long way to go. You can't just sit here and say, oh, yeah, we're going to go win the rest of our games. That's not how the world works. you got to go and do that. You you lost. You That's a loss for you today. That's a loss. I don't, I don't think so. I that's think for a, a, I think for a team, I, I just think that for I, you guys... I, I, I don't know what's for, wrong with you, that, Why would that not be the loss? Listen, I don't know if you're being dead off right now. Corey, Corey, listen, Corey, listen to this, yeah? Listen to this. Manchester City... Against the big five teams, forget you, Nat, forget you, man, respectfully, Corey, yeah? Against the big five teams, wow. Chelsea, even Chelsea, Arsenal, Liverpool, these men have not won a game. Tottenham, 
They haven't won any of these games. I put do you three think that faster. don't matter though? You have a big game and you haven't won a game. Do you think that don't matter though? Going forward, of I don't think it'll it matter. matter. Of course I don't it think matters. it will. Look, look at the table. Forget about that, right? Look at the table right now. I'm just saying this is... Look, 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 look. If, you, if this was Liverpool today, let me just tell you something. If this was Liverpool Football Club who came and got a draw, I'll be like, it's okay. It's Liverpool. But it's because it's Arsenal Football Club. I think you winning today takes you to the next level because you man haven't mm-hmm. won anything in 20 plus years. And I think you guys... You have this inferior uh, mentality to City. And I think you slapping us today could have just given you the boost. And look at this now. Liverpool are front. We keep arguing amongst each other. But Liverpool are front and quiet. And look at that run. So I think if you want today, there's going to be a big boost. Because trust me, it might end up you second, us third. But both of us don't win a title. But City still have a treble. What do you have to the table? No, no, no. See, what we're not going to do now is go and talk about your honours and why it's okay. That's not, that's not what's going to happen now. Yeah? What's going to happen now is that you said you was winning, but you didn't. And again, I, keep, I have to keep saying this, yeah? That again, I'll keep calling it a loss for you, guys, because it is. Are you, are you not upset with your performance? Uh, uh, and hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. Do you know what I'm seeing right now? A whole lot of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you. What? That's that's what that's what you look like right now. Yeah, we that's are. You're right, right. You're 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 right. But the fact that none of you got Montel, the win. How about this? How about hey, this Mon, can you still hear that? Yeah. Somebody that wasn't here no, today, no. somebody that wasn't here today in Casey, when you was losing, I he said, yeah, he said to me, oh, does it look like I need to win the game now? I was like, hold on a second. If if Liverpool are losing, you really need to win this game today because that will that will take you to a, to a next team. Yeah. Now, it now, is. Now it's a right must win for both of us. He was, his head, his head space was like, no, man, a, a, a draw's calm. A draw's calm. Yeah, yeah, I think, man, this is, this is a weird. The weird this, this is you the mindset. Weird, the draw is calm for us. Hold on, hold on, kid. This, this is, this, you know what I'm saying? This is the mindset. Because, you know, Corey, you know when we beat Brighton, and you know when th- this game ended in a draw, you know what I was thinking? I wasn't sitting here thinking, yeah, we beat Brighton. I was sitting here thinking, fuck, how did we not beat City at home? That yeah. I was thinking. How did we not beat City? When we played them, I'm looking. I'm still looking back to that result, thinking we could have been four. We could have sat here, and I would have been four points clear. Yeah, four but you see that clear. mentality, man. That, that, you see your mentality. Your mentality is different from this man. This man are celebrating and popping bottles for the draw. No one tries a little bro right now. No, 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 no. That's what I'm saying. No one tries to confuse what I'm saying. Yeah, I have not once come in here and said that I'm happy with a point, and I'm and I'm this and I'm that. I'm just saying, I will take it. I've just rocked up to the eight he had, which arguably in world football is the hardest place to go. And, and I've done it. I've made... Huh? What? what? Bro, go and, Man again, is making bro, up bro, things. You're making... Go and, check, go and check their last... Bro, go and check their recent games that Etty had. These, man's, these men haven't not scored a goal in the game since 2021. In 57 I've, games. I've come here, I've come here today and nullified them, bro. I've nullified them. Like, who, who no, 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 but, but you know what? No, it's no, it's, no, it's no, hard no, for I, you. I need, can, can I, I need, a, I need, a, I need a thingy. I need a um. I need, hold on, chat, before, chat, I know you're loading. I know you're loading, but I got. Let me just do these three super chats. Also, <laughs> kids, another fine thing works when you're fourth and they're first, but not when you're fourth and when you're first and they're and they're second. Months, I'm, I'm above them. First. I'm above them. Let me, let me. So it's, it's all right. Big, I'm I'm above big up Giovanni Molina with the super chat. He goes eight centre backs on the pitch. Both were scared to lose. I know it's sickening, blood. Big up Danny with the super chat. He goes, biggest myth. If you want to win the league, you have to win away at a rival ground. In the league, Klopp never won at the Etihad. Pep Nubble never won at Anfield. No, Pep has won at Anfield, but there was no fans. I'll tell you right now, this quick myth. This, you know this whole thing about, oh, yeah, like City ain't won at Anfield or, or they've only won once at Anfield. We've never won at the Etihad. And guess what? We have one Prem and they have five. So, so, so maybe one of those wins that the Yeti had would have got us some more Premier Leagues. And most, and most before knows? I forget, and most before I forget, we, you and you and my team, we've been in this situation where there's a bigger gap. Like this one, Arsenal fans are making me laugh. We have had a bigger gap 
of eight this season, and Mons came into the Etihad and didn't take a wing, but they were like, oh, we have five points in front, it's fine. I'm just yeah. saying, we should both be disappointed because Brighton almost had it, and then Liverpool found a way. And we are yeah, here right, arguing right. while Mons is going on with the girl home, and we're arguing over who's going to who's gonna pay a taxi fare. I don't know, man. It's not good for us right now. You can speak for yourself. I'm good. I'm good you man spent you, you spend hella peas on drink. <laughs> I pulled up in my night tech and just whizzed home. <laughs> Said, darling. <laughs> all this cool, bro, Mons. You're anyway. only two, you're only two <laughs> points above us, bro. <laughs> just the hey, two. Hey, hey. hey. Hey, hey, like hey, hey, who was them two, them two you two just talking to? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, you don't know them, no? Like, me <laughs> <laughs> I said, me neither. <laughs> okay. Bro, I thought your friends. No, it's no, funny because, bro, they're, 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 it's only friends. two points. <laughs> You're only oh, two oh, points oh. above. That's You're looking at what's kind of flustered there. But no, yeah, no, bro, sorry, how no. can you bring back the team with two points ahead? That's nothing. You're just lotioning right now. No, but listen, 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 listen. I need... I need a backstory. Yeah, going into this game, I would like to know what was Kier saying. What was he saying? Was he? Was he? What was he saying about this game? Because that's what I need. This. That's. I need to have an angle here. So I need the angle right now. So what was Kier saying prior to this game? I think he did say that he'll come to the Etihad and he'll win. And I said, uh, if I'm honest, I think I said on this show on the preview, I said I think we can we can get a, we can get a win. I said that. You didn't said, say think, you said you no, will no, get no, a win. No, 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 no. You, no, that's what you said. That's what you said. I said I think you Yeah, we both... No, no, Patrick, Patrick was more adamant than me. Patrick was more adamant that he was going to get the dub. I wasn't so adamant. I just said we can. Yeah, no, no, no. We, but I think like, it's fair. No, no two teams said we're smacking you. No one said that. Yeah. I, I just said you're not leaving. I said you're not leaving with anything, but maybe the, the best way to do is a That sounds too confident to me. Way yeah, I said you don't. Leave. I said the best you're living with is a draw, and guess what you left with today? A draw. And you know what's making me laugh though? Let me just oh okay. Gosh. Let me talk with the big chest here. You man thought that because you've been slapping Newcastle five 0 you've been man, slapping Burnley five 0 I think some of you guys from Arsenal actually thought you're coming to the Etihad to slap us with goals. I knew this was not going to happen. But the thing is, I'm I'm bored, man. I'm so bored. I, if if I take and Pep wanted to do that. They could have stayed home and played chess. Because I, I, I'm, I'm done. That was just bad. Nobody wanted to step up. Nobody. And you can see... Are you happy going. with the performance? What? I'm happy with the defensive performance. Yeah. 100%. Oh, are you? But the, but the attacking... <laughs> I'll be honest, the attacking... <laughs> <laughs> you think I was able to go say that? One's home. One's home. Can I just continue to ask, like, can I just continue my, my I've just conducted an investigation here before I begin. But um here's why do you think he was gonna win? Because they got no um they had no walker. I thought they was gonna have no stones. Um and obviously they got they got injuries everywhere. So it's like we, we have a fully fit squad bar timber. So I thought this would be the one still. I thought Nelly was gonna start. Maybe if I did, if I knew that Nelly wasn't gonna start, I would have changed my prediction. But yeah, he didn't start, so kind of messed it up, but I don't know, man. Like, I think so you, feel, you, you feel that Man City was at a disadvantage? Yeah, yeah, with the injuries they had, yeah. 100%. Yeah, so you didn't take advantage. Again, it's still, so you didn't take advantage. 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 You had the opportunity. Yeah, you had the opportunity because you believed that there were certain certain the advantages that went in your favour with injuries and whatnot and you didn't take advantage. Let me tell you something now. Every so often in the season there comes a, all you hear from 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 your from your 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 fan base is we are a different team. And I've heard that come out of your mouth several times. We are a different team now. We're a different team. We're and every level. time when you're a different team, there's 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 certain moments in the season where it's time to show that. This was it. This was yeah, it. And it, today showed it. This was show. it. it and show. coming out of there with a nil-nil, yeah, if you're fighting for top four, yes. That's a, re- that's a great result. But if you're going in there, top of the league, yeah, if you win, yeah, you was top of the league when the day started and you ended up being second now, it's not a flex. It's not and, a flex. And you actually went down. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, not, I'm not everybody, flexing. everyone in this league, including me, because you just—that's what you've been asking for, kids. You've been asking for the respect. You've been, you wanted respect all season. 
You had yeah. the opportunity to claim the respect today. And as a result, there's no respect. There's Why not? Why <laughs> not? Because we didn't win. <laughs> Again. So, so you're telling me, so because we didn't win the game, there's no respect. Ake, didn't Ake go down within? Even Ake went down. They, we gave you every chance, though. Rico Lewis was playing in that, in that midfield. <laughs> okay, let me just say this. I think, I'm just going to say this. Maybe this, this, this will also sound a bit chesty, but I just think with the form you guys were in and with the players you had and the bench you had, you, your bench actually looked better than us for the first time in a long time. You the fact, I, team, I, I, listen, the fact that Ake An, An went down, Stones couldn't play, when the Bruyne was half fit, and you rolled up and said, oh, we still need respect for a draw. I don't know. I thought you, you know, for a minute, I thought you guys were going to come with chest. I thought you guys, you're going to come after us. Because I remember, I remember a Liverpool side, I know it's Anfield, but I remember a Liverpool side with kids who went after us and made us sweat. More than you made us sweat. I'm just saying. Bro, bro, you, you, you brother, you done worse than us today. You was you was the we're, we're, talk, we're talking about your side right now. We'll get onto the city. Side. No, no, right bro, that's the problem. You. You're not gonna get onto city. This oh, well, is I, will. I, get onto I will. This is, I will. This is what I've got to say about city. Yeah, the, all the kids. We're talking about you, right? Yeah, that's fine. All, like I said, all you're not gonna try come for us. And, and like we we done, we fucked up today, and and city were okay. So, what city, were, the, city were the only team. Okay. City were the only team. Okay. 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 City have not scored against us this Trust season. the process. Don't just worry. Wait. Trust the you process. Just wait. Just I, I, cool, wait. but this is but here's but this is what I'm saying here yeah, for real. Right? <laughs> Again, City, City were the home team, right? They were below yeah. us when this when this um, day started, and they're still below us. Like I said, they have Patrick. When was the last time you didn't score? A he had. When was the last time? That's this and that's this and that's. You're not getting. You don't get. I'm, I'm, not, not, asking, I'm not asking. You don't you don't get, get, this is embarrassing. I'm, Bro, no, I'm just, oh, yeah, it's, it's because I'm gloating, you're gloating at the fact I'm that you haven't scored it. I'm just, I'm yeah, just asking a question. I'm just asking a question. Patrick, this when was the last bit, time uh, you I didn't score? Bad. When was the last time you did not score at Ehad? Wait, is that, uh, is that a, uh, do you want to flex on that? The, uh, bro, I'm this just what I'm saying. It's, it's been a long time. It's been a long time since the team kept us from scoring. But I have seen Christopher. Right, right. So do you not feel like you fucked up today? Do you not feel like really. No, really. Why, why not? Why Look, not? Do you, do you know? Okay, let me tell you my disappointment for today. My disappointment for today is the fact that let me let me. Why it's very disappointing is the fact that Liverpool won and we didn't win. We drew because I just know that with the Liverpool hype of that, this is Klopp's last season. And how I know Klopp, this might be the end of things happening because I've seen this before, even in the season they won. But what I'm trying to say is, I think this your friends here <laughs> are trying to say you wanted respect. But you're not gonna get that I respect. Listen, because... I don't want respect. I don't need to get respect off United fans. That's something I don't need. I'll be wait, real. Hold a second. Why do you? Why is my name being mentioned? Because <laughs> you're, 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 you're my friend, bro. You man are my friend. What, what do we have to do with it? No, no, chaps. That was different because you was talking about a whole different thing. I'm talking about the title in general. I don't need respect. I just want to know. I just want to know. Listen, cool. We don't have to respect. But listen, I put it on my Instagram. Yeah, these man. Yeah. This this game, see the hype around this game, yeah. Certain influencers were outside the Etihad doing the Rashford celebration, <laughs> yeah. Tell a man to believe all that extra stuff that was going on. Wait, wait, do then we they were doing this? Backs, four they were DMs, doing this, yeah. Four DMs, yeah. And the Crab Twins, the world class Crab Twins in Bukayo Saka and Foden doing niche, yeah. Yeah, yeah. both niche. dead, both dead. I can't niche. lie, both dead. But, wait, but we was told one was but, better than the other. But, but so as I'm saying, you want to sit down and have these conversations about who's world class, who's not. This was maybe the they're moment. both. This was the moment, yeah. <laughs> and as a result, yeah, maybe both. Liverpool are now firmly in the driver's seat <laughs> because obviously they're points ahead now, so it is in their hands. And unfortunately, it looks like Arsenal are going to be another. It's going to be another nearly nearly season for them again. Why is, why is that? Because we're two, it's so right. two points off Liverpool means it's done. No, no, no. no, no. I, don't, I don't think it's done. But when you look at it, yeah, from 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 a from a perspective, it's like we look, we we go off what we know or what we've seen happen. We know Liverpool can do this, put together this run at the end of the season thing. We know City can put together runs as well. We know what you man do every time you man rock up to a challenge <laughs> that you man are supposed to overcome. You fail. That's so. It. 
You know, that's, that's, that's not... It's that's not what ten, you got a tendency to fuck up, up at this stage of the season. You can do that. This is the issue, kids. You haven't shown us that you can... I don't need to show you. See, this this is where you man to keep messing with show. I don't need to show you guys. what I I know what we're on now. And oh, like you I know said, what you, you know what you're today, all right, cool. So today Dave, can you explain it, to me why? I tell you why today proved it. Because again, right. every single time I've seen us rock up to A, he had we've just been getting spanked, bro. Every game, it don't matter about injuries or this or that. Every game we pull up to the Etty had we get smoked, we get bopped. Yeah, today was not like that at all. We didn't give them shit. Harlem, you didn't do shit. Harlem, you bunch you bunch you bunch shit. Ray Keen, Lee two player. That's what he said about Harlem. Lee two. But, that's okay, what we did. We made it feel like that. Us. Do you know? But you know where it is, yeah. You guys didn't do anything. Again, that's that's a separate argument. It's and not a separate argument. This is the point. It's the same topic. The way I see it, it's the same topic. Upset? Yeah. I'd be more annoyed at Arteta for the fact Arteta that he didn't prove how to actually is a coward. He's a coward. He's a coward. Bo- both managers. Like, I'd be, I'd be both... more upset that we didn't like, bro. I'm pretty sure Monto was very upset that. What do you call it? He didn't win that game, even though they drew. He was more of a fan. It's funny, though. It's, yeah. it's funny, because at the end of the day, bro, we... that you drew that game where you didn't no. even, like, you didn't even, there wasn't even a chance for you to actually win it. There, there was there was a chance, and I'll tell you when. Like when? I said, bro, there, there was a, bro, if, you could even argue, we had more of the um, clearer chances than City. You could even argue. Wait, what was it in two weeks? You played, you played like Austin. What chances did City have? So you played like Manchester United. What was the position percentage? You played like Manchester United. We don't know what I'm asking. What chances did City have throughout the whole game? Nathan, okay, okay, head on. The okay, okay, one. The Harlem oh, one. That, 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 in his hands. The Harlem one. What? Bro, what, what Harlem? What Harlem? had a few. The one. The one. Bro, no, 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 no. I agree. I agree. There are barely any. Sorry, I'm in my iftar, innit? I'll cover my mouth like this. There's barely any chances. Both getting clear cut chances. There was none. There was none throughout the whole game. But and that's my point. I messed up for you, man. All I know, yeah, Arteta has been on the phone to Ten Hag because what the f- was that, bro? What was <laughs> you that? Know, that what, I'll tell you what, listen, just like how obvious what that game was, yeah. Today, that game was simple of, it's just a game of chess. And both managers were shook. That's, yeah, that's the reason. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't shook. That's it. I was but, shook. Know, but this is why I said to you, bro, if, if Arteta parked the bus, you might not leave him with something. I don't, think he, I, I don't think and, he... and we know it's never gonna happen. We know that's never gonna happen, in it? Because yeah. once you're good enough as a manager, you're never gonna park the bus. I yeah. wanted Klopp to park the bus for the game. We didn't need to in the end because somehow we had a better game than them. But the, the fact of the matter is, business end, business end of the season, going into the game week 30 plus, it's just about the three points, yeah. And I understand that losing the game would have had huge ramifications in it. I'm not disputing that for either team, City or yeah. Arsenal. But imagine. The, the the value in winning the game. I think the value it would have been mad again. Was, yeah. It's crazy, yeah. and I only look at that from an evidence point, as an, an, an evidential standpoint. Because when you look smoked us, you went on a you went on a rampage, bro. You went on a rampage, bro. Mm. If you yeah, but, but once, once with so that, the reason why I don't, I'm not on that, and I don't agree with that, is because and that was at the end. I, by the way, I know what you're saying as well in terms of like get a big win and you can go on a big one. I, I hear that. But my point is with that is, even if we was to lose, win or draw against human at home, what we done, we would have done that anyway. Because that's that's the level we're at. So it's it's not about, uh, yeah, yeah win this, then you can go on a run. You can't say that because prior to that, you went five games without a win. So No, no, but, but, once it, but, if you, but then if you could look at another point where against you and City, who are my two biggest ops this year, we've collected four points out of six between the both of you. And to me, that's that's title deserving. You can't, you can't knock that. Wait, we've not lost what? against any of you this year. Wait, what? We've not lost against any of you this hold year. Hold on, hold on, hold on. K, K, K. The two, K, the two K, biggest K, title K, rivals K, I've not lost against. K, 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 K. K, 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 K wait, wait, wait. There's been, there's been seasons I've beat, I've beat them and drawn against them. Both of them. I think I've, I've been, there's been a season I've beat City or Manaway. Holly. Yeah, but Corey, then what about the rest of the games? But what do you mean? That's what I'm saying. We've been... You're missing the point. Hold on, hold on. Let me land. You're missing the point. Like, I feel like... You, I feel like a lot of the Arsenal fan base are going for these little victories, these little, you're like your little one ups. The bigger picture is if you look at the top six table and how Liverpool probably are bottom or, or fifth ahead of Chelsea or John, we're probably the worst. We haven't beaten any of the top six apart from Chelsea at home, 4 1. But we're sitting top of the league. 
So this no, yeah, yeah. Can we go back to what we said though? Can we go back to what we said though? Like the other day, same panel, right? Bar Casey, we said if Arsenal draw, it's acceptable, but let's not act like if you didn't win the game, if you don't win this game, you're not going to be fuming because deep down, I'm fuming, bro. We, you know what, you now <laughs> what you've done, you've made the Liverpool game in our hands again. Yeah, yeah, you've you made the cast. Liverpool are going to fuck this first person to You're going to fuck something up. I'm but yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what we said to Casey. We got onto Casey about this. We asked Casey, where would you rather be right now, first or second? And that man looked us in the eye and said, I'd rather be second. What the fuck am I hearing? <laughs> what am I hearing? <laughs> like, I'd like, I'm sorry, but I'm pretty sure title no. winners or title challenges or anything like that should that you'd rather it be in your own hands than have it be in someone else's hands. Yeah. Regardless of if you think Liverpool are gonna bottle it or not, or Liverpool are gonna drop points, it shouldn't have to be that. It yeah, should we, never we, be that. You take it we, one we game at a time and hands. you have it in your hands. That's crazy. Bro, the point it's the point crazy. is again, it's not even about whether you finished first or RB first or second. The main the main point is just to be there, be up there, and that's the only thing that matters, bro. Because again, I'm what? I'm currently dead. I'm currently there now, yeah? I'm second right now, and I'm there. Bro, next week, it's only next week, couple days, Liverpool could go draw. Who you got in the week, man? No, no, we're not doing that. No, we're not doing that. No, 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 Wait, so next weekend you got us, Monzo. Kids, kids, no, 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 but kids, this was my point when you guys went <laughs> I tried to, do you remember when I tried to put that point forward? I said it swings and roundabouts, and you know what? I said, you guys are going to draw, I'm going to beat Brighton, and you were like, oh, I don't know if you're going to beat Brighton. I said, I'm going to beat Brighton, and now I'm going to have them on with the chest again. It is what it is. My only thing is that I can't, like, I just feel like you Arsenal fans couldn't wait to put the pressure on someone else. You couldn't wait to tell someone else it's in your hands. So all eyes aren't on you. Because when all eyes are on you, I, I'm not, I'm struggling to see where, I'm struggling to see where the the victories are, the monumental victories. And, that, and that's not to say that it should happen all the time, because winning at the Etihad is something that is barely ever done. Winning at Anfield is something exactly. that is barely ever done. I understand these things, Kate. But when you're fourth, when you're fourth, you can sit here and go, you know what? I went to the eight, you had a 29% possession and I went and got a point. When you're fourth, that's something you can be proud of, yeah? But when you're ahead of Man City and you want to kill them off and dead them off, this is why I hate, I hate drawing to Man City. I hate drawing to them, I hate losing to them. Because when you have a chance to dead them off, you need to dead them off. They can't, mm. even the fact that- Make they, sure the they're dead. Three points between us, do you think three points between City and Liverpool right now is enough for me? It's not enough. Yeah, no, of course it's not. not. Enough. But I'm never dead enough unless I said twelve points. I say twelve but points. At the end of the day, bro. Points, yeah. At the end of the day, all this talk and all this criticism is on Arsenal. We're not looking at City, who again have pulled up today at home, needed a win, please, just like please. me. Corey, please, let, me finish, let, let, me finish, let me finish. Let let me finish. Yeah, pulled up to the A. Had needed a win, just like me, as you might keep saying, and they got one shot on target all game. No one's speaking about that. It's just all like it's it's all an arsenal. Awesome. And people are gonna be like, oh no Walker, no forget all of that. A Kanji's coming who's more than capable. They've got a hundred million pound centre back in Vardio who's coming. There's no excuses. There's no I hear it. Because you're sitting here telling you're sitting here saying, Oh yeah. A, a, a draw is dead for you, man. When you're you're part of the problem, it is dead because I'm months. Like, they're at crazy. home, bro. When you're at home versus any team in the league, especially competing for a title, you do not lose, bro. That's the not sorry, you don't you don't drop points. That's the number oh, one rule. You do man. not drop points. What does City do today? Drop points. When I played City at Emirates, I won. You both, you so I can speak. That's what I'm saying. I, I can speak like that because I won. I think the big I think the bigger picture is being missed here, you know. Because at the end of the day, yeah, the reality of it is, is that <clears throat> for the last two seasons, you lot have been trying to win the Premier League. If City walk away from this Premier League and they don't win it, I don't think they can be bothered. They, I don't think they can they, they have any, because they're established ch champions that have won the league on numerous times. And I'm not saying this is an excuse, but my thing is this. As an Arsenal fan, you have seen your team play good football. Even in, even in shit times, you've seen you lot play good football. Yeah. The point is now you need to get from playing good football because playing good football, not winning nothing, it's, 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 it doesn't mean shit. You need to win something. And today you had to lay down a marker to get yourselves ahead. 
to get yourselves be taken seriously in this title race because all you're going to be see, all for me, I just it just goes to show you that the mentality hasn't changed. As long as you're not yeah. playing good football, as long as you not win, you you not win a few games against the big the big oppo- opposition, get yourselves into Champions League football and whatnot. You might have to sit and argue the toss, but the reality of it is, is that in the last two seasons, you've had ample opportunities to win the Premier League, and you have, and I don't think you're going to do it again. Yeah, that's fine. Like I said, chaps, and it's funny because your point yeah. is, and you keep saying this, it's like you man's point is, I had to win today to try to prove a point. I don't need well, to prove anything. Like that. I don't you need not to... made it like this. No, no, because no, I don't need to prove anything. For the last to two anybody. seasons, you don't have made it like this. <laughs> the City game and the Etihad. That's where it's at. Yeah, that's what you. That's what the last two seasons. That's where you lot have made it be at. So it's it's there. That's where it is. It's there. Yeah, no, no, yeah, that the game. Cool, fair enough. But again, we, it's it's not done by any means. And the fact no, is, no, one, no, no one's and, saying, and no fact, one's saying, it's no, no, but, but no, it's, it's opportunity, opportunity missed. But, opportunity again, missed. But once, but that's very naive. Just to just say to yourself, ah, oh, I need to rock up to the eight you had and win. No one's. That's, I'm not, that's, I'm not saying, bro, that. bro, it's, bro. I'm not saying again. I think you're getting it wrong. I'm not saying title's done. I'm saying opportunity has been missed. In fact. There was even an opportunity because you didn't even want the opportunity. It was put in front of you and you're like, oh, you know what? No, we're going to play like we're still fourth and we're going to play like it's still 2012. We're we didn't. Like that, still that wasn't our intention to play like that. That wasn't you know, you know that was the intention. For me, for me the, ch- the chess game thing is just weak. Like, I'm, again, I still think you lot have come out of this better than Man City. I still think this draw favours Arsenal. But right. it's not like... Right. I don't understand why I'm seeing on my timeline. You know what? Fucking hell, great fucking draw this was, lads. I'm so proud of the boys, man. I can't, you know what? The fact that we walked away from the eight had a, with a draw is now, you know what? This is a great, this is good, man. I'm I'm happy with the boys. We go into the next game. Rare, tear, 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 tear. I don't know who said that. I don't know who said that. Like I don't know who said that. If we go and win, this is going to be monumental. Like, no one, like, the, 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 the mentality for me, and the, the worst thing, the fact that you lot caved in on me on Friday about my mentality and challenging for the league and then talking like this after a draw is, is fucked, bro. It's bro, fucked. but no, but who's speaking like that, though? <laughs> this one, this one I don't get. And it's funny, again, because it's, it's, you're human are saying all this, yeah? But again, end of the day, we walked up to the... And I, I keep saying it, yeah? And I know this, it, it's obviously going to be boring for you rival fans. But again, we walked up to the eight he had and I'm going to say it was a tactical battle. I'm not. I'm not here to be in a title race, uh, to put on a show for the ops. That's not what I intend to do. I don't care about putting on a show. Months, if you want to do that, which you do, all your games all exciting and that. That's all great. Chaos football. That's all great. <laughs> I don't need to Jesus. do that. If I wanted to do that, I'd be in the top four race. Yeah. I I go to games to win games. How I like to win games. Yeah. Mm-hmm. As a city, as a city player. Sorry, as a city team and an Arsenal team. We both like to control games. So if we both like to do that, bro, what you saw today is that you should expect that. You should expect but it. You, but you didn't I, control the game today. A quick one. Like, how didn't we? Did, what chart again? What chances did he, apart from the Ake thing where Raya collected it in his hands? Like Wait, what chart are you are you trying to say you done like the Porto thing against you? But you could yeah, you could argue with that. You could say that. <laughs> no, you, no, you I, I, I can't what these men are on now. You can just say that. I can't what these men are on now. It's just that no, you're spot on. You're spot on for you. can, can I can I can I interject? To be fair, possession wise, you got dominated. Like you got suffocated. Yeah, yeah, no, facts, facts. But in terms of consecrated, no, bro. This is cute going to Arsenal, bro. We need to start having a conversation about Kevin De Bruyne now, like because thank honestly, you, I, bro, you. we need to get some of these Man City players. Patrick's just sitting there all cute and everything, like he ain't got five, <laughs> like my man is sitting third place, fam. Like, <laughs> KDB is looking like flipping Home Alone more and more and more, fam. When he was on drugs, fam, because he's I don't know what's going on, fam. Because nah. boy, he's nah, been stinky just... since Luton, t- bro. He's been stinky. No, honestly, I think they're worse right now. I think it worse with him in the team, innit? Yeah, he's <clears throat> somehow after that after that injury, let me not lie. It's not, it, look, he came he came back with a few sparks, you know, in the Luton Town game. He done for them, but it's Luton Town. Um recently even Pep has got, had to sub him, talk to him. I think I think he needs I think this man, as Pepper said, needs a break. That's why I think he has to mm-hmm. just retire from Belgium. And I think where he's going, he just has to concentrate on playing for City. But let's be honest, you're right, guys. The man was thinking. Uh, KDB always owns uh, Arsenal, and I didn't see any of that. And to mm-hmm. be honest with you today, guys, I'm happy that both the Star Boys stank it. But one of the Star Boys got sat down by Gav- by, by uh, Josh Cavadio. So hold that, hold that. If we're doing it as a win, then you're no better than a... 
a Liverpool Arsenal fan, but I'm just or a Tottenham fan. But I'm nah, just nah, nah. Yeah, 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 right. KDB has been great. Kate Foden doesn't. needs to start going into that. Like, Foden's been cooking this year, yeah. When he goes in the middle near Haaland, when he does those runs, he can't get him, and he puts him out wide and just says, "You know what? Sit there, stay wide." He played traditional four three three with the fullbacks. He had an overlapper. After that, he made my Rico go inverted. He still did nothing. So it's like go in the mid, go over there in the wing and hold that. And then obviously Greedish and that comes on. It's not his game. He needs to be free roaming. Otherwise, it's just like, what's the point? He's oh, he's been in the round now. It's time to take the, the you know the reins, isn't it? In my opinion. Yeah, I think so. And I think you're right. I think it's time for him. I think it's time for Pep to also see that look. KDB maybe is going to have to become an impact player, you know, and let Foden cook in that midfield. Because to be honest with you, when he hooked up Foden, I was like, why are you hooking up Foden for? Why don't you yeah. hook up KDB? Because KDB is doing nothing. Uh, but it is what it is, man. Uh, Cass, as the Arsenal rep told us, they came there to play a chess game to keep us to zero goals, which they did. So they succeeded, which is another masterclass by Saliba. And I anyway. told man about Holland as well. That guy's a scrub. I've been to the man. This guy, if he's not if he's not bagging, he's doing absolutely nothing. Man, yeah. talk about Jesus, that stinky strike of yours. Yeah, at, least Just Jesus, that, that's in at, at least Jesus had some chances. I mean, we know about no, Jesus already. Jesus is but again, so Patrick, shit. you could so there was no point sending Jesus because he would have done the same thing that Holland done for you, man, today. Nah, so but, was, I, but 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 I don't think Jesus could have won us the trouble. Let's go to you in it. Like, what, what was your way to watch? Big up, Danny I'll be... for the hold, hold on. Mm. Big up Danny for the ship. Yeah, go to chat like this game was at the Emirates. Crazy. Real talk. Big up Danny for the Real talk. Um, e, go on. What was your thoughts on the game? No, I think we are being a bit harsh on Arsenal. But at the same time, I get you man's point. I always bang on about these men the last three seasons. Fucked up top four. Fucked up the title. Top for like 90% of the season. And this season, I think they need to prove side. But I think... A draw at Etihad's not bad. I think it's like fifty-seven games. Um, they they haven't they've a team's they failed to score against someone, so it's impressive that they also kept a clean sheet. But the manner of the game, like it was just never looking like you look were trying to win the game. Odegaard dropped a stinker. Saka, no, listen, I don't even, even want to talk on Saka, bro. You might as well yeah. pull the injury card, mothers. Odegaard oh, definitely never had a stinker. You. That's that's of course cat. he did. He, he didn't. Did. Bro. He, he, looked, he, he looked like he was scared of the ball. He looked like he was shying away. Yeah, this was the type of game we needed to step up. No, he didn't see this. That's not down to him. It's because you tried to play counter attack, and that don't suit. Yeah, it doesn't suit him. Yeah. Saka, I agree with Saka, 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 Saka. Why did Kai Havertz stay on the pitch? That's what I was confused about. Why the hell did Trossard that, keep running and then square that ball? Yeah. Do you know yeah, what it is? You know what it is? I, I think that's an Arteta mistake. If. If he either if he takes off Saka instead and and sorry if he if he puts Martinelli on the left and puts Trossard on the right, if Martinelli had that ball on the left, mm. he's kicking it and uh, and Akanji's not catching him and he's yeah. squaring it and he's squaring it because Trossard don't have the getaway pace like that to push it and square it because you saw Martinelli was there for the tapping but actually it should have been Martinelli on that side to square it. Do you yeah. know what I mean? And I think that was just, I think, unfortunately, it should have been Martinelli on the other side. So maybe that was just an Arteta tweak that maybe you should have had the wingers on, on the on the opposite yeah. side. But listen, from a Man City perspective as well, yeah, they were weakened, obviously, Ake injury as well. But I'm starting to look at you guys now and think, where is your run of games going and I'm, that's not to say you lot can't go on a run of games, but it's like, I'm looking at you lot in the big games and obviously the ones that City have left. I mean, I think you guys are very fortunate that you lot don't have too many crazy games left. Like you don't have an Arsenal to play. You don't have a Liverpool to play. I think you lot are very fortunate because, again, much like I felt like we should have we should have smashed you lot when we played you lot at Anfield, I'm looking at players like Harlan and KDB and the players that are stepping up for you guys, I don't know where they are. Gundogan and Mahrez were sorely, sore, all season. I don't know, like, I feel like they're the guys that maybe would have got something out of some of these games. And going forward, you just, you, you don't just seem like you lack edge. Doku, I never feel like he's ever going to score. I don't, I just he, don't, he I don't, so I don't feel like he's going to score. Like, so don't get me wrong. Get beat, when he beats his man, no did he? when he does that, I feel like, Eight times out of ten, he is going to skip past his man, especially if he's not doubled up on. 
But the bit after that, it stinks. It's St. Maximin. That's just all it is. It's St. Maximin in the City shirt. <laughs> right Jack Grealish, right. for me, was all right. But it's like, are you going to shoot? Do you want to shoot? Is anyone going to shoot? I feel like Rodri was, Rodri was probably the one where it's like, all right, I'll, I'll try to look a shot off. But it just got blocked. Man, They're doing no the old Arsenal thing, isn't it? They're doing the old yeah. Arsenal thing. Yeah, trying to walk out to the net. How about this? Walk the ball into the net. How about this? Why, why is no one talking about KDB and Inshallah? Why is no one saying that today? Yeah. Why is no one saying that? <laughs> Just quickly, Patrick. Because Patrick. when it comes to Trent and Liverpool running out of ideas, oh yeah, get the ball to Trent and spam nah, it. Nah, man, we have... No, we have it. It. Spam it. That's what no, I said today. No, we haven't been great, bro. Hmm? this season we haven't been great, let's be honest. And, and that's why when I'm telling people that I'm shocked that we're still third and I'm shocked that Certain like teams have allowed us to still be close like this because I I told people I told our city fans when Gundogan was going I was like this guy is a hero this guy carries us and they're like no De Bruyne is more important I was like we we admire is going we might be in trouble here it's just the team with Nunes coming in Kovacic coming in they haven't sunk in yet and for the fact that people like Mares and Gundogan played with Pep for so long they knew his system and we don't have those players in this team it's actually left a big gap. Even as bad as saying Laporte wasn't playing, but every time Laporte plays at the end of the season, the man used to keep us clean sheets and Laporte was very good with carrying that boy into midfield. So, mm. I don't know, man. Uh, every time I wake up and still see CG third, I'm surprised because we've been garbage yeah, this season. That's your base level, bro. That's your, yeah. your base level. Like, the I worst know. you man can get is third in the Premier League. Yeah, that's what? what I'm saying because... That's, that's let's your not, level, let's, let's not lie, like, this season, there's times when we were playing even against teams that are like mid-table and they were ripping us into pieces and the only time we've made it is because maybe Haaland scores a goal and Foden just turns up so we've actually been trash that's why I'm saying I was like deep, deep down inside if I'm being honest as a City fan I was actually expecting Arsenal to come and, and attack us and then slap us but the fact that they came and showed us respect and packed the bus like this it, it actually gave City a chance because I think if Arsenal went full gun full guns at us. I think we are not taking that pressure. I think City, we're not going to take that pressure. Because I've seen Chelsea, who are 11th, come at us with pressure. And we were we were all over the place, trying to get the ball off the back. So, big up to Arsenal. Uh, big up to Arteta. Maybe he did not want to embarrass his old master, you know. So, you're right, Mons. We haven't been great. I'm telling you, we haven't been great this season. If you look at it, we haven't uh, been great at all. Listen, I, I hear what you're saying. Let's, uh, we've got people that do need to head off. Um, let's segue into... Um, a quick chat about Man United because Corey, you are not getting away with this shit. Yeah, <laughs> you are not getting away with this. Wow, you look at the time. There's at least, at, least two minutes, at, least, at least two minutes of this because, bro, like, let me just get your thoughts on your game because we'll talk Corey, about it more on Tuesday. But bro, Corey, bro. Corey, is Rasmus right. injured? No, he just played shit. I'll be real. Just wow. come back, really. He's, like, he's just that, shit, to, like, that was oh, dear, shit, like, I've Honestly, I was I was watching the game. I was I was placing bets for Brentford to score. Like, like, bro, yeah, bro, look how bad Whoa. our team was. It was man said bro, you've got I haven't told me what in the flesh. You haven't told me in the flesh. It was so bad. Like I haven't got like I actually don't have anything to say. Like I even tweeted. I said, I said even that, no, no, but no, but you man was on top of Me the world. No, but you, you hold on. You, uh, do you know, and cause obviously, when when you leave Korea, uh, don't worry. I'm, I'm like, you're lucky we don't have. There's no, we don't have free bin boxes on this. We actually only have, we, have, we don't even have free bin boxes. So it's one of them ones, isn't it? So when you when you leave, unfortunately, traps and cats are gonna have to hold that in it. But like, you man were all like all guns blazing after the FA Cup win. Um, Cass had me sitting here telling me how he's gonna sneak into the top four. Remember that one? It was literally just this week, Mama telling me about top four. Well, How about you know what I'm We still are. We still are. Man, man, they were telling me that the gap's going to get closed because Tottenham and Villa are shaky and that. But man forgot to watch his own dinner. Man forgot to watch his own dinner. Bro, it was so bad, fam. Like, that was bad still. And, and I know that after oh. that Mount goal, the, pan, the, the delirium, the delirium when Mount scored. You see, you see when I saw a dirt, that 1-1, one, one, 99th minute. It was like a, it was, it was like, it was like, like one told, did you see anything from me? Did, did you huh? see it? Bro, I, I said nothing. How about this? Because oh, deep yeah. down, a part of me thought that we were going to score. I swear to you. Yeah, but I didn't yeah, know but who. Even, 
I didn't know so, who, but I thought someone was going to score. Wait, the, you like, yeah, you, that, and that's what, it, like, yeah, that's coach. what I love about United. Like, you man, get your pip in your step when, like, maybe a couple of results go your way, and then yucky, you know, man. ten hog, yucky, ten hog, and then shit yucky, tactics yucky, just bring you man back to back to reality. You know? Happy Easter. <laughs> this is man's manager, Easter, man. Happy Easter. You know what I'm saying? This is the manager. Bro. Bro. I where you are. I know you need to go. We'll, we'll steer on to the Liverpool is, game and then we'll go. So mad. Like, this is my I can't lie, yeah. Even though, yeah, even though people will say with the manager, oh, he ain't, he ain't had the players, or like, oh, and we'll talk about his style of play, yeah. But that for me, and then even the press conference after, like, that for me, yeah. that whole situation there is just sackable within itself. That, that what whole did little thing, he said, even the season, struggling. how. How how the season's gone? That just that little part that he played there is sackable. No what accountability. Was, what you said after that. Like it no was so mad and it was so bad. You know, people will talk about Kobe Mania and be like, "Oh, where was he?" But no, he was literally playing by himself. You, you see, I'm quickly. I want to speak on that quickly. Yeah, you, you, well, you see man. that main. You see this main new thing, and this is why I said as well. Yeah, you see all this. Ha- and by the way, I'm not this a brilliant player, but all this hype around his name and that. I knew this was going to happen because he's and it even fooled me. Because when I was watching that United game, I was thinking that like, menu, that like, come on now, let's do something. Like, let me see something. But in reality, he shouldn't be there, shouldn't be any pressure on this kid at all. Thank you. Yeah. Should, I shouldn't have had a long few weeks. Yeah, like, I shouldn't well, be expecting him to do stuff true. every game. Like. That's what and happened with United, United, isn't it? That's what it happens. Happens, like, mate. Bro, it happens, every, it happens every, every English player. Really yeah, yeah, literally, yeah. literally. Like, should uh, being honest, should you man really be expecting stuff from Garnacho? Uh, listen, give it to and you've got a senior left winger in restaurant. I'm gonna lie though, he was, only, he was the only one trying to play football game. yesterday. Yeah, bro, every uh, there was there was one case with McTominay and there was one case with Bruno. He does oh. a, a nice silky one and he wanted it back when he runs further forward, didn't get it, they passed backwards. Says everything you need to know about IQs from an 18 year old compared to all these. A yeah. 30 and a flipping whatever book Tomine is these days. Garbage. So, like, wait, wait, wait a minute. You're, t- you're telling me that you guys are sitting there. Wait, wait, let me let me get this right. You guys are saying you're sitting there saying may may, may do something else why there's people like Bruno in the team. Oh no, no, no Listen, everyone knows that Bruno is stiff, in it. Like everyone knows that now. Nah. Like, but Bruno, yeah. Bruno is a senior player, uh-huh. captain. Yeah, he's senior, uh-huh. he's seniorly shit. Mm-mm. No, I'm there. Sorry, I'm not having this because, because the, the 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 generational PR on Maynu's name, and then when he doesn't have the great PR, hey, man, 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 no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're heading down a dark and yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 Calm wait, down. Wait, you, you're just going on Twitter. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Stop right, saying wait. who said this about generation. Stop saying there who said this. I'm not saying you said it. I'm not saying you said it. Anton Ferdinand. Anton Ferdinand coming out to the bed can I show you something? Come on, come on. 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 Come on, come it's not fair on me. Sorry, this is big six pants. So now that you're in the hot seat and you have to account no, for the stupid that you're representing your night. Wait, 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 bro. No, this is what I said this yesterday. On it was only Friday that I was getting cussed out. Can I ask you another question? Let's not do that. Hold on, let me land. Let me land. Let me land, bro. When I when I was talking about I wasn't cre- I wasn't twerking for Alonso. Oh, but once your bandmates was twerking for Alonso. So now, so so again, so the, the generational PR on Kobe Mainu's name, let Kobe Mainu just be Kobe Mainu. He's young and obviously he's going to make mistakes in that. Obviously he's going to make mistakes and whatever. I don't think he was to blame. I don't think he had an awful game. But this is what comes with a player just being young and he can have average and maybe under average games. It's okay. But the way his PR's going, like he's not going to be allowed to have games like he did against Brentford. When really, there's nothing wrong with his game against Brentford in my opinion. Nothing wrong with it. 
No, it was Nothing a bit of a tired it. performance. Well, we, we can flip the same thing as well. It's the same way, isn't it? It's a bit like saying about your fan base's generational PR for your team, for Connor Bradley over Trent. Or we could say the guy that actually won the Carabao Cup final was actually Van Dyke and not Klopp's kids. But yet they went along with it and called it Klopp's kids all of a sudden. And it was only a few of them yeah, on the bit. That's, and, that's, and, that's anyway, and that's called the And that's called... That again. And that's called... I'm going to flip it. Mons, you, you might not say it, but you said it to Corey. You know, man, did you say the Hungarian Steven Gerrard? No. We're not talking about the We're not talking about the why is this conversation starting with Kobe Mayu? He should never. Oh, because, never because when you're, talking, when you're spoken never, about in a certain... When you're spoken about in a certain... Like, 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 what happens, like, you know what happens, that sounds, bro. Like, being honest, you yeah, should be yeah, looking yeah. at freaking... Obviously, the, 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 the usual suspects, we don't even want to get onto them because we just speak about them on a, on a daily basis. I find it quite boring. Like, for me, I am going to be looking at... Um, I'm gonna say team. the whole team. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Hoyland. Yeah, Hoyland for me, like he had a bad game, and I kind of expected more from him because mm. he kind of changed up his play in recent times, where he was trying to do the actually get involved with the play, make a run. Like he didn't do that for me. He just done the. I was going to say though. Sorry, sorry. I was talking about you, Kobe Mane was being compared to in it. Now we do. Now we do. I'm not, I'm not with that, bro. Too, no, I've never seen really. anything like that. I'm not gonna I, lie. I was being told he's better than Pedri. And Who, like I, don't, I don't, I don't remember that one. But yeah, anyways, they don't, they don't even say Pedri. Anyways, Stop anyways, anyways the brother's 18 and get better comparisons than your players ever get, and that's one fact, and that's just a straight thing, isn't it? No, no, let's let's be real. Mainu is class above all your youngsters, fam, by a, a gazillion miles. Is that's one thing. And anyways, let's get away from the eighteen-year-old too, yeah. Fam. Generational, better than all my youngsters. What do you it's mean? You, your fan base and I included, which I still believe and which you still believe, called Trent generational. But you want he's he's like 24, 25, and he wants him replaced. It's meant to be once in a generation, but he wants him replaced by a kid from Northern Ireland. Allow yeah, it, I and I don't agree with that. Allow it, yeah. And I mean, I mean, they yes. don't agree with everything else as well that people say, but yes, yeah, you yes, are laughing. Yes, 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 yes. Trent backed his chat. It don't matter, they still want him out. They the usual fan bases, they still want him out. They want Bradley there, and they want Bradley. And do you know what I say from that? Stupidity. It's just dumb, acidine. You know what I'm saying? It's it's, it's ridiculous. But, no, Monty, don't work like that. Monty, don't work like that. No, no, no. Did you just give that same respect to Corey? Did you give that same respect no. to Corey? No, 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 no. no. That's not. That's you just not about respect. It's not about respect. No, it's I'm not. saying that. Anything. You sat. No, no, Cass, because you sat on. You sat on this uh, on this panel. So did Corey. You sat here yesterday and caned me yesterday? for something that my fan base said that I didn't say. So what did you say? What did you say? And when I spoke about everyone else, and when I spoke about everyone else. Hold on, and when I spoke about everyone else gassing up their own their own reasonings and for whatnot, man, them told me I was deflecting. So please stop deflecting onto my fan base and let's speak about the the new current Sadal that you might have in the center of the park, man. I have, anyway, a, a, anyways, like this, you, 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 we, can, we can blame a lot of players yesterday. Yesterday is really and truly. If you want to talk about it, Aaron Mamasaka got caught blacking at the back post. The man's man's yeah. married to that and that offs and keeping players on side, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's he can't stay on. If you want to get on to anyone, that, let's go on to Scott McTominay. But Traps has gone about it, he's gone somehow, it's just gone, vanished. They don't want to talk about Scott McTominay. Talk about Bruno, Captain Lee, the legend, yeah. People want to say better than the best sign. is Eric Hansel, whatever, piss off. And then you got other people like. You got no, his name's not even Alejandro, his name's Alex. Yeah, Alex Garnacho, crap, hooked. Yeah, talk about Marcus Trashford. Huh? How about that? And yeah. talk about Hoyland's name, garbage. I Where is it? Got man them. I'm gone in it. I'm gone, man. Them. Done my thing. Yeah, no. no I was, was, <laughs> not in jail but, for long. But like no, I said, man. anyways, yeah, like I said, anyways, yeah, about this thing, I'm meant to believe that all these players are meant to be worse than Brentford. Bro, that's a management thing. Why there's no one ever on a side? No one's there to the side. They're always front forward. The guys, guys, Sam Allardyce, but the Dutch version is crap. By the way, Brentford haven't with what won two games in the last eighteen, two draws in the last eighteen. That's they've cute. Lost, I think That's they lost bad. fourteen in their last eighteen. That's it's cute. Is it actually? You're struggling. Yeah. Are you, yeah, are you, you struggling? There's no league like sides. And they, you they just mashed you man up. It's crazy. <laughs> No, I'll be real. Yeah, hold back wait, line wait, 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 like long term injuries. When this guy drew today as well. No, 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 no. no, no. They drew against City. 
Do you know what it's Cass? You was in the middle, but because your United, your fellow United fans have deserted you, unfortunately, <laughs> you're in the bin box. I, like, listen, this didn't have to be like this. There is, there was the bin box for you and Corey, but listen, don't worry. When Tuesday swings around, then man will get, then man will, you get what I'm saying? We're going to... They'll get the treatment. Is there anything else man want to say about the United game? We're gonna I want to, I want to say one thing about, because it's like, there's obviously, like Cass said, there's obvious candidates like Bruno and that, but the main yeah, one for me is, is Rashford, bro. That you see that oh, guy, shit. Oh, shit. It, it's actually mad because it's a, with him is so annoying. Because on his day, that like, this guy is unplayable. Like honestly, I've seen nothing like it on his day. But the problem is, is that that day comes at every three months. That's yeah, the I'm, problem. I'm so, tired of hearing Rashford. So jarring, mums. It's so tired, jarring, man. bro. Like he's actually done. He's, he's just done. There's no saving it's that crazy. guy. I promise you, there's not. If what's your kind of before we move on to the Liverpool section, what's your kind mm. of um your take on the cheekiness? Because I know as a Tottenham fan, you've had to hear a lot of we're gonna catch you, we can't wait for your bottle, it's gonna happen, rare tear tear. Like, what's mm. where do you kind of stand knowing that you went and got your three points by hook or by hook or by by crook, you got it done. Now the gaps, I believe, eight points is it eight points? Yeah, I have a game in hand, probably. I I promise you, I do not care. No offense, Cass, in it. I don't care what these men have to say to me. We're a bit inconsistent, but these men, like with everyone fit, it's just a mess. There's no direction. Like I can't see when they're gonna score a goal. They can't attack against everyone in the flipping league. Like, it's just ugly. And I don't know, I've been there with Mourinho and Conte. Like that stuff's all dead. Like it's probably with this current squad, that's probably your most effective way to play. But there's too many deficiencies, isn't it? Like, there's too many tactical errors. Lindelof left back, like Cass said, Wambasaka can't keep a man on side. Like, just it's like it's not good coaching. They're not well coached. They're not anything. It's just a mess. I, I can't explain it's it. Right. I think the difference is. Yeah. I think the difference could be though. The thing is with Tottenham, they struggled against Palace to go over the line. They struggled against Luton to go over the line. They actually played a good game since well, one good game in ages, and that was Aston Villa, and they're still getting over the and. It's all getting over the line, don't get me wrong. But that inconsistency doesn't mean when it comes to the bigger sides or even a, a, a bit more of a sharper side that's got a bit more of bite about them, like a Nottingham Forest maybe or whatever, that you're going to drop points. The thing is with Man United, this is what I say about with scammers, fam. Yeah? We play, who we got next? Who we got next? Chelsea. We'll probably go beat Chelsea. And Liverpool. We'll turn up beat. against Liverpool. Yeah. And we'll probably turn up against Liverpool somehow. But then you, man, in a team that you're expected to beat, you drop points. And then we're having another yeah. conversation. This is what I mean. Man United are scammers. In in that in that on that kind of point, you do have a point, but it's like you've got man. Arsenal, Man City, and you've got Liverpool. I don't give a toss. And you've got Chelsea away. This is you, why you and, then, and then you'll go you'll go you play someone like away. Bournemouth and lose 3-0 at home. But the something. thing is, after we're done with that little bit, like we got a majority a few of our games are quite at home. And to be fair, not really teams that can really play counter-attack and all that. So it's that's why I'm a bit more confident. That's why I said I'm expected. I want to. I think we're going to beat Brentford, but at least in some of these one of these games, I guarantee we drop points. There will be one. There will be one. Really? And right now, it's come early, but we'll probably end up winning. And this is this is the shocking thing about Man United. They want to turn mm. up for the teams like I don't know. They want to play a little bit better. They want to go out there a little bit more, like against the Liverpool and then Chelsea. It'll probably be light work. Yeah. And I just I just don't. Understand. It's a confusing team. But all I know, Ten Hag shit. He's a board for Doctor Eggman from Sonic. I don't want to hear it. Get gone. Go back to flipping Dutch uh, Holland, man. Getting on my nerves. Yeah, he's, he's why, why am I I'm an Arsenal fan. What are we doing? I'm on loan. Yeah, my man. Yeah, Chelsea, yeah. Away, Chelsea away. Go on, Kat. Go on, okay. No, I was gonna say it's an eight. It's an eight point gap, but you haven't got a game in hand. We do have a game in hand. We no, got no, Sheffield. Tot no, Tottenham haven't. Oh, we they don't. do have a game. They do. Your, your game in hand is um, Chelsea. Yeah, we should Just definitely. Have how comes? Hand. How comes they're both on? Wait. You're both it's, on it's, it's, United, United, United. United. Tottenham and Tottenham and United are on the same games played. It's yeah. Villa, you guys both no, have, you yeah, both that, have a hand on Yeah, Tottenham got a game hand on Villa, but not on United. But we don't yeah, have like, a game on hand on United. 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 Wow. United and Spurs have both played 29 games. Yeah. And yeah. Eight points, 48 and 56. Eight eight and, and United play Chelsea next and Tottenham play West Ham next. Uh, all right, listen to their next oh, five. Wait, Tottenham's yeah. West Ham? Chelsea yeah, away, Liverpool at home, Bournemouth away. Sheffield United at home and Burnley at home. I'd right. say three out of five, you should be winning. I think you could definitely fuck it up, Ethan. You, you could, Sheffield there's a well. potential chance that United do finish above you. I, I, I watched this kids, yeah. This, I, what, what's this? Is it Thursday? But a lot of these games are Man United end up beating Chelsea, which we are, yeah. 
and yeah, top all drop points against West Ham, and all of a sudden it's a different shift. And guess what, kid? I guess what, Ethan? You're in the bin box with the juice. Yeah, you're you're in the bin box. Why do you think you'll be in Chelsea, bro? Because no, Chelsea, of they are. Chelsea is shit. We just got Chelsea's number. It's just that. It's just that, isn't it? We just got their Chelsea. number. We just want to have a habit of, of turn up against the big clubs as well. Yeah, who said we're a big club this year? We smashed them. Actually, we absolutely annihilated them. All. I'm, fu- I'm funny. It should have been signed like 6 2. Yeah, I'm not scared true. of Chelsea. And you know what? They had their saving grace last season was at um, the bridge Kovacic. Kovacic. They ain't got oh, yeah. Kovacic. They got no one. They got Enzo. Now you got Cole Palmer. Do oh, you think I give a damn about that guy too much? Just put one Cole- Sacri, man. Cole Palmer, these Maguire, and. Um... Uh, who's it? Martinez. It's Martinez back. I don't. I don't. Yeah. I, well, hopefully, but I'm just saying. I don't. The only way you deploy Wan Masaka is if it's against like a Mo Salah, like an important player, not against the flipping who was even right wing back for them. I don't even know. Roslev, that that Roslev or that bro. Ukrainian you or whatever it was. Yes. <laughs> it don't make no sense. Oh, yes, I, 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 I an idiot, honestly. Yeah, <laughs> I I just feel like you man. Obviously, you have something to play for. We'll see in it. That's it. Literally, we'll see. Where it's it's going to be interesting. I won't lie. Because I, I actually didn't even know that it was that low in terms of the points. I'll but be wait, wrong. Cass, why are you focused on me and not Villa or side? Why me? Uh, we only need, I have, shamelessly, we only need top five. Four, fifth. If he gets you Champions League, what's the difference? Who gives a crap? Who actually gives a crap? <laughs> no, it's true still. It's true. Wait, is that I guarantee you, that's I still, I'm still back in my prediction. Yeah. I reckon Villa end up dropping out anyways. So they're going to, I think they're going to scam out. Out. Let, let's see how they cope with three games they, per day. Three, three they, game, uh, games. Yes, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. You got to focus on your own dindins before you say anything to I am focused, it, well, how, how does that work? How does that work? I will focus on mine, but I'm going to be looking at other results anyways. It's like when you got Gallia, but you see a next one go by. She's in the same league, but you're not going to go talk to her, but you're still going to eye her up for two seconds. That's what I'm going to do. I'm still going to eye her. I'm you, my thing. You can, you can eye up Spurs and Villa all you want, but when you're when you're out here dropping points yourself, looking at them, man, ain't going to make no difference. I, I guarantee, I, look, I guarantee this conversation on Thursday, whenever it is, yeah, it's going to be another conversation. Man United somehow go and beat Chelsea, whatever way they do, and then Tottenham drop points against West Ham, and then all of a sudden, it's a different conversation. It happens every week or two. There we okay. go. Well, all right. All right. We'll, we'll have to see. Um, Liverpool 2, Brighton 1. Um, boy, boy, oh boy. Um, let me get to the Super Chats before we, we, we speak about that game. Um, as brief, and we'll keep it brief and we'll obviously go into it more on Monday. Um, love United, hate the up says it's cool, Monica. You can focus on how bad United are and Ten Hag are, but your team hasn't won against us this season and Klopp has only won once against Ten Hag. Said this about the Arsenal man and the little dibby dibby wins, you know what I'm saying? It's just about the bigger picture, you, you know. And when the bigger picture isn't in front of you, I just think some people refuse to see it. Big up, you like love United head ops, though, you know what I'm saying? Mr. Link says, Man United's Coutinho, we must have been um, Man United's Coutinho, we must have been unbearable. It's crazy. Um, big up, love United, United head ops for another super chat. He goes, Mad that Kobe has you, man, still active. It's not even a rattle team. I'm not no, nah, I'm not rattled by listen, main news is a good player, man. Like that's that's not that's it not true by opinion on them, but it's just like in my opinion, not saying it's from it was from Castle or Corey or anyone else, but the overall hype around this this youth's name Crazy. Is, just, is too much. It is too much. That's well, the because he is performing at a top level, isn't it? Yeah, no, nah, he's cold. Main news cold, but it's like the way yeah. you don't speak about him, it's just mad, it's a whole different level. Oh, different. No, not, not really. I wouldn't say so. it's normal for a kid to get gassed up. It's just it's, just, it's been that way since. What, the... what about when when Anton Ferdinand? If I, that he wasn't even the maddest one. There was someone that said something mad. I forgot. The Seidorf one for me was crazy, bro. <laughs> the Seidorf thing. The Seidorf thing sent my head to the sent my head to Mars, bro. And I was like, right, is this what we was doing in the trend? Fuck. <laughs> secure. Just right. a quick question. Do you <laughs> think he, you think his England's uh, spot is secured with um, Rice and Bellingham? Oh no, oh, yeah, I think yeah. that's a I'm, I'm just, no, no, it is, it is, it is. Right, over Madis. Madis yeah. over Madis. What's Madis doing in position? What they don't even play the same position. That? They don't even play the, the same guy, position. Guys played like fifteen good like, games, Sam. Even you know what for me, yeah, you play ball in it, and this yeah. is where this is where when some people say how's Harvey Elliott getting in, but uh, not getting in, but Kobe Minor, bro, they don't play the same position. What are we doing? Even you're better than. No, no, even, no, I believe no. in you. You're better than no, this. No, 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 I no, 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 no
Declan Rice can do the job that Kobe Maynard has been asked to do, therefore would leave a space for Madders further forward. It's not like a straight like-for-like like swap kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah, but but it, maybe he doesn't have to start, but he deserves a call-up, 100%. We all, we all know what's happening yeah. anyway. Henderson's coming in. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It'll be Henderson. Uh, I think he's done. <laughs> But when nah, people bro, are saying Mayno's Mayno's um, spots are many, bro, Europe, if you don't think Mayno is is gonna start, then, then I Europe think as a DM, it. he'd be like a probably a Calvin Phillips kind of thing. It'll probably be the backup DM in it because he can't trust Calvin yeah, Phillips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Southgate. That's, that's, that's what I can see as. You know, you know what's gonna happen, in Southgate. Eighteen-year-old starting in the Euros for England. I don't think he starts. We all know what he's nah, like. It won't happen. It will yeah. start. He will start. Who did he see like in the ten? He likes Bellingham there, and who does he like next to Rice? Uh, typically, he will put Gallagher there. Watch. Gallagher. Yeah, yeah. Well, it will either be, it'll either be Gallagher or Henderson. One of them. One of oh, them so be fair, Gallagher's profile does fit for the system, like Cass was saying. Play <laughs> Rice, holding Gallagher, Bellingham. It's nah, not man. Bad, it needs to be. It needs to be better than that. It needs to be better. But I'd yeah, say so Foden. Like, Gallagher started against Brazil. Brazil's B team and got bots. Is this yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. That's, that's what it's happened. Been, bro. We'll, we'll, but we'll, we'll move on. Obviously, big up. There's still 235 people in the house right now, but there's only 115 likes. Guys, please hit the like button. It's very important. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, please make sure you subscribe as well. Big up everyone who's sending their super chats too. But we should at least be on 150 slash 160 likes. So again, if you haven't hit the like button, it's the thumbs up button below the screen. Um, you should find it there. And if you're on dark mode, it'll be white and if you're on the normal mode hit it and it'll be black so you know you, you, you guys say, are, man say Mason Mums, I was just about to say that what are you saying you know what, 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 hey daddy for bother bro, I, was gonna say, yeah, I was honestly going to say you know what's so brazy is that if, Mount, like. if Mount keeps his pace in this United team I promise you he's going to Europe. I, I, that's all he needed was that Morgan Stratford. That's all he needed was that one goal and that's it that's all it was bro that's all it was that's all it was now he's going bro he's going to go he's going to go if Madison doesn't show up yet from now because he hasn't yeah, shown up done. and he's if Mount gets done. another goal or two that's all South Wales is going to look at but that's, that's all he needs that's it it's true but um, guys let's let's move on because we have not too much time <laughs> Liverpool to Brighton one. Um, Liverpool obviously have gone now gone top of the league by two points. And before you guys want to ask me the question, yes, it is in Liverpool's hands. It is firmly in Liverpool's hands as it stands. Um, Sheffield United next. So hopefully again, just again, that's that's a that's a real opportunity to to knock the goal difference down from six. I believe Arsenal's is forty six. Arsenal's forty. So that's a it's a big opportunity to to claw the goal difference down. What I'd say is certain things worried me today and certain things excited me today. I go on about Thiago, yeah, even though his legs are gone. But you see McAllister, yeah? McAllister. He is the truth, fam. He's too Fucking cool. hell. He's operating on a world-class level, bro. Fucking hell, bro. Oh, man. Without him, we actually well, done that. You tried to sneak in the sand and the season shot on the, on the previous yeah, no, yeah, no, 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 if Liverpool win the league, he signed in the season. I agree. I agree. I agree with you on that part. If Arsenal probably... win the league, Rice is signed in the season. I think it's as simple as that. Carla, you know what it is? He's not as glorified yeah. as he should be, though, because yeah, yeah, because yeah. he's not in the I limelight. More. You yeah, know what yeah, it's? Yeah. You know it's? No, it's because he's not in the limelight. He's thirty-five minutes. He's quite a quiet Rice character time. as well. Um, where Declan Rice is always on social media stuff or always doing some sort of video, and obviously it's Arsenal. It's a bit different, bro. Right now, as it stands. It's sign of the season, bro. McAllister has yeah. got seven goals and five, no, seven assists and five goals. Yes, credit a few have been kind of penalties, but it's not not the point. Like, a couple of his goals being bad. I can't, I ain't got much, I haven't got, I haven't got a praise for him because, mm. bro, from this me? guy, is, this guy is moving nuts. You know, it's, it's just, he's going to find a Champions League, like bread and butter, you know, it's because, you know, when the Champions League is more structured, and it's used more time. There's weirdly more time as well. Yeah, it's yeah, gonna, it's yeah. gonna shoot. What, what, what I like, I like yeah. that he operates everywhere in it. So if he's deep, he's mm. he's dribbling under control. He's looking up, picking out the right pass. If he's a bit more advanced, he's picking out the right pass. Wait a pass. It's just I love him, man. He's too technically sound, no, he's like, and good. he works hard. It was like boss line or he runs and all this mm. stuff. That's dead ones. That is dead. No, so is like, the truth. Is. McAllister at eight is. Sometimes yeah, when he's deep, 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 this deep, 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 de
everything like that's that ball from McAllister to Salah happened about oh seven. Oh my eight. word. That same pass, like he mm. literally had it on lock. Like, you know, when they get usually we see that get over here, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Get over here or under here. It was just perfect every Bare time. Awareness. I'm, looking, I'm looking at Salah thinking, brother, you should have four or five goals, G. Like yeah. this guy is feeding even the little inside one to, to Bradley that he kept doing in between the centre back and the left back. He just kept doing it. And mm. again, for me, like Again, like what Ethan said, he's running a lot as well. He's not just kind of he's not just sitting there pretty in the midfield waiting for the ball to come to him. That's then it. he can kind of do what he needs to do. You know what I'm saying? One thing I would say is that I was actually kind of like I was I was happy with um with Sabozlai today. He played a part in, in the goals. I was thinking, you know what? Usually I'm more hard on you, but today he was better. He played Ooh. like it was a really good it was a good pass for the uh for the second goal, I believe. Um as well. I mm. think the main guy I want to speak about, though, is not even Sabozla, it's Luis Diaz. Because, again, we've all Ooh. been very critical of Diaz. And he fucked them up today. I'll be the first to say he's not performing. He wasn't performing. But recently, give it, like, what, last two months? Two, month three, yeah, yeah. I'd say last month, innit? Yeah, last yeah, three games. Yeah, last month, month yeah. yeah. Cold. Cold. Yeah. And, and that, like, when you're performing like this, the end product will come. Like, his decision-making's getting better. He's beating his man. Do you reckon what's the injury you things? Listening to social media, you reckon he's hearing? He's hearing the chat. It's his dad. It's his dad. His, his, his dad's dad, just bringing yeah. the good vibes. <laughs> Trust me, though. He's happy <laughs> again, right? And then he's gonna he the talk to Barcelona or something like that. The thing is, Mons, he's still selling them though. If a, if a good bid comes in, <laughs> but, but this is why I said, bro, if Diaz. I'm saying 50, 60 mil for Diaz because he has that in him where it's not like he doesn't have that player in him. This is the this is the Diaz I feel like we're seeing from when he first signed. And I That's think honest. sometimes it just it just takes time for certain men to get going after they either have an injury or something's happened. Um, yeah. I I think with Diaz, yeah, he's he's frustrating because we should be seeing this more often than not. But let's be honest, the story of the season has just been non often than not. It's been the opposite. Let's keep it a buck. So the re the reason why everyone's critical is because that's what we saw today and the last three games or so, even against City, regardless of the fact that he didn't score. We're seeing a madness. We're seeing everything else that you need from a winger. So, mm. like, you know, to, have to for your end product to be that bad at times, you have to call that out. I'm sorry, you have to call it out. So, for me, I think he's done... The best thing that he's done is amongst the people talking about his dad, because I feel like his dad shouldn't have said that. I think this is the wrong time for your dad to come out and say, oh, you know, th we've always wanted a Spain move. Two teams kind of came in before he went to Liverpool, but Liverpool showed the most interest. I think when Liverpool are needed to win every game, and Diaz is one of the guys that's going to start every game because Jota's not there. You know what I'm saying? And Gakpo's not good enough at the moment. You, your son's got to be dead at raring that's to go, like, like contributing to this to this title push. You ain't really got time for your dad to be waffling about how you always wanted to go to Spain. That's dead. Yeah, Speak about that. That's dead, bro. So I feel like Diaz responded in the right way by shutting people like me up and going, yeah, I'm you got, like I'm good enough to, I can run this team, bro. I'm good enough. He should have had two goals today rather than even getting one. You know what I'm saying? So, Offside usually, I've, I've, yeah, yeah, I've been on Diaz in it, but I, I, I can't hate in it. He cooked them today. I think he was better than Salah today. Even though Salah was dangerous, Salah. dangerous, no, dangerous Salah was, but he was much better than Salah today. Like, yeah, no, definitely. They both got a goal each. I just feel like every time Diaz got the ball, I thought something was going to happen. Something was gonna happen. Well, like, another stinker from Sabozlai, though. He needs yeah, to. No, he, 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 I was gonna I say, he, man, I don't know why man was saying he played good today. He played he didn't, man. You know, what he, he was great today. I don't think he stunk today. He no, 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 no. Sabozlai, so, 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 low, man. Bars low. low. That's, that's your favorite line as well. Yeah, he keeps rushing. Stop rushing. He, like he would accelerate and then he would stop and he would have to try to think and then try to play it. He needs to stop rushing sometimes. It's like compose yourself. The, the runs are there though. Like Salah's runs were there. I think Nunes was just kind of like, what? I don't even know what Nunes was really doing. I didn't really notice him. Yeah, Nunes was really in the game today. He has well, there. Well, I think people don't understand what Klopp did as well. And this is why I get my tactical head going on, yeah? You know what he did? You know, because Brighton were popping it for the first 10, five minutes. They were kind of comfortable. Not popping, but they were comfortable, right? And then all he did was move Joe Gomez on the inside, which allowed Bradley to get further forward a little bit more. McAllister to get further forward a little bit more. You kind of noticed it was Luis Diaz down that whole side all the time. And then Luis, and then all you saw was Sabozla kind of like start hanging off the left a little bit. From about 20 minutes after that, Brighton had nothing. Stunk. Crap. Mm. Not even another chance might come and it was a half chance, if anything. I think Keller made maybe one decent save. And that's all that really troubled him. 
Mm, it was yeah. annoying because uh, Amons Dinker was banning him. Uh, Dinker was just banning him. Yeah, yeah. Bradley. Yeah, Bradley, Bradley was having a tough. Amon, 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 pick you up because obviously Brighton tend to be your bogey team. You overcame them. Bit rusty up into that shit, right? You got fucked. You got bummed up by a Dingra. A Dingra banning yeah, up. But, That's but, what but I was saying. Bro, bro, I was just saying, bro, just I keep doing that. Just keep I, I need him. I, no, 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 no. Do you know what happened? Um, Klopp put uh, Kwanzaa on a Dingra. No, but even when Kwanzaa, Kwanzaa, I saw that. When, even when Kwanzaa was there, yeah. he still got in behind. I saw yeah, it. a few times now, but I feel like Kwanzaa grew in. I think he's Kwanzaa yeah, Kwanzaa started. grew into the game because he had a shaky first, like, yeah, bro. Because you know, what? you got to remember, bro, man, them. I know it sounds mad, it's not even an excuse, but you realize a few of our back lines are academy grads in it, like, you yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. So, there are going to be times where players like a Dingra or like a Martinelli, them guys are gonna, they're gonna get, they're gonna bun up, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, mm. I'm telling you, bring me, you man know how much I rate this a Dingra kid, bro. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm on my he's bro, he's 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 tired, tired, he's tired, I need him. I yeah, need him. No, 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 bro. If Diaz is leaving, fuck everyone else. Bring me a dingo. I need him. I, I need him. I need him. He's that good. Oh, you know, bro. he is good. Really, yeah. bro, just, just people talk about Bradley in it, and, and Cass, this is why I know you'll back me on this one. Mm. People will say, like, there's parts of our fan base that are telling me Trent go in midfield. Trent, if Trent's not in midfield, he shouldn't be playing right back, and Bradley should just play right back. Today was an example that stop acting like Bradley is this defensive juggernaut. Def Bradley was good going forward today, and that was it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going backwards, he got fucked up. He got fucked up. And I love... Yeah. And I love Bradley's, a, Bradley's a top talent. No, no, Bradley's a top talent. He's a top talent. But he got fucked up today. He mm. is not... Like, people act like he is well ahead of Trent defensively. He's okay defensively. It's just because... Trent has been bad defensively. You look at Bradley and go, oh, yeah, this guy's defensively cold. He's bad balance. No, no, no. Bradley is better going forward than he is going backwards. He's just better than what we've seen from Trent last season. I agree. Defensively this season. He ain't even been that bad defensively this year. It's just that the bar for right back defensively for us is not very high. So you see something and you think it's this amazing. Bro, to just to think that Trent should be going midfield or he shouldn't be, or he should be on the bench or rotational is insane. We argued for five years that this man was generational. Now, as soon as a, an academy grad that looks slightly more balanced come in, automatically, you think he shouldn't play right back anymore. It's it's delusional. It's delirium. It's crazy. It's, that's not that. It's dumb. It's, 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 it's utter idiocy. I can't... It's so annoying when I hear that. Because then, then we might as well just say, folded and said, you know what? Reese James is better than Trent. If you don't really want balance, because that's what it shows me, the fact that man, man, these are sucking off Bradley because he's yeah. more bad, you might as well have been sucking off Reese James instead. When he was fit, no, like that, I just no shade on Bradley, but just be objective and say he got bun up today. He's good going forward and he's okay defensively. He's all right defensively. He's he's just like they're not. He's not world better than Trent defensively. That's all it is. Yeah. That's all it is. Like let's not do the whole oh just because we've seen something decent from an academy, academy grad, we just dash the whole Trent stocks out the window. It's dumb. That's why I had to say that. I had to get that one off my chest. Right, once he's highlight, like you've been holding that in for us. Bro, you yeah. might have seen the arguments yeah. I had with my own fan base. Cass, you've seen it. You've, you've sat there and watched it, bro. I've had to argue my own fans telling me, God, oh, you know what? Yeah, no, if Trent ain't willing to play midfield, you know, I don't even think he needs to play right back. I'm not going to lie. Like, he just becomes a rotational player. Excuse me. Excuse me. Impossible. Yo, I said, I haven't seen that. And I oh, sorry, I just saw creams in it. Buy one, get one free in it. Trying to trying to treat yeah. myself tonight, you know. I was right. going to his money. Oh, God, sorry. Yeah. What was your thoughts on the whole Trent Bradley thing? Because I know you're very much against. That, nah, but... man, it's it's washed, fam. As soon as this kid gets into Champions League, as when he comes out against a, a decently techy little winger, that's it, man. Start getting exposed a little bit. And to be fair, it doesn't even matter because. We need to see who the manager is, regardless. I don't think Bradley was poor the whole game in it. It was just the first half, if if anything, if that, if that, like he was he was sound after that, but then that's because maybe the whole team is stabilized. I think him going further forward, I think he's better further forward than he is further back. He, he can actually spot a good cutback. I'll be real. He's actually yeah. quite he, him and Trent kind of I mean sorry, him and Salah kind of have a decent relationship when it comes down to on the pitch. But Trent, this whole midfield, why would you want your midfield when you when you love Endo so much and love Curtis Jones so much and love, what's it called, so much? Uh, McCallum, it makes no sense. Endo. When Amarim comes in and you play that wing back, you're not going to want Bradley there anyway. So you're going to want Trent there. Mm. You're talking about Champions League winning side. The Champions League winning side doesn't scream Bradley yet. Talk about letting someone land. 
let him land then. Right? Same thing. Liverpool are good though, man. It's a shame that you're gonna lose against us next week, but well, not really well, a shame well, about that. And then I, Arsenal I, will go back on top, but we'll, we'll and I, need, I, need I, I think one person that will have to be spoken about soon. If Quanta keeps this up, man, I don't know if he's too is he too good to be a rotational player at this point. I really think I really think he's not as good as Kanati, obviously. But you see with Kwanzaa, he's more the Matip. I think he's like a mixture between if you're looking at player profile, Matip and um Kanati, because I think he's actually better on the ball than Kanati, in it. I don't know if you like disagree with that. I think Kwanzaa's better on the ball. Like his ball playing ability is better than Kanati's. I still think Kanati's the better defender. Mm-hmm. Like he don't want to come up against Kanati. Let's keep it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But like he's he's for 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 someone who was playing in what League Two on loan. Should he really have been having a, football, a future Liverpool football club? Come on, Matt. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, man, it is. So for him to be coming in and doing what he's doing, I think, yeah, like he's, I, I do, I, I do really like what I'm seeing from Kwanzaa. But yeah, the, it was worrying down the right side. Like Brighton was like, a dinger. the worst thing is he didn't just do what Bradley made him, like he sat him down, like he sat him yeah, down. Yeah, no, he completely he finished him, bro. He, like, finished he folded him, him innit? It was a bit, it was a bit tapped. But listen, I think Brighton actually played quite well in terms in terms of playing at the back as well. But listen, man, at, at the end of the day, we take the win. I feel like even though we went one 0 down, and that was by the way a bullet, bullet. That was a bullet from Welbeck. Just give him that. Yeah, well. yeah, you snapped that still. You slapped. slapped. It. And even slapped. I was like, but I didn't even get like I didn't even get gassed in a slide. So I knew yeah. It. Too early. It's, it's the same same at the Amex every time at Anfield. It's the same. Yeah, script. maybe if it was at the Amex. Yeah. Yeah, if it was. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. One of those yeah. games. But I'll be real. Mm. I, I even I didn't even really flinch when we was one 0 down. I think that's just kind of the story of our season. Months, I was saying to kids today, yeah. I'll be real. I'm not gonna miss this this whole aura that you got at Anfield. Like you might go a goal down, and I'm I'm just know for a fact you're yeah, gonna come back for next you're season. To, you're, you're numb to it. No, yeah, I'm numb to it. But don't worry, next season that's done. Yeah, that's we'll have, see, we'll have to see in it. Listen, the Zerbi your audition was good. It was only T one anyway. No, but you know what I'm saying. So <laughs> listen, listen, yeah. Listen, we'll see the, the bar is low. <laughs> listen, the, the, listen, the um, the, the, the it's in our hands at the moment. And for me, I still think we need like I still think we need the likes of Trent and Jones and Jota back. And I think these two ones will turn into four ones, maybe. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I feel like yeah. we still need a bit more clinical edge. I feel like on another day, Salah should have bagged more goals today. He easily should have had a hat trick today. I'm not. I'm not hearing it. Like I know he's only been back for two games, but brother, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It is mm. what it is, isn't it? Um, listen, you know we're gonna end it there. It's been a good show. It's been a good chat. Um, we'll be back tomorrow uh, for the late night Liverpool show, and obviously on Tuesday. Oh, it's a Premier League preview. I was, I was going to say we speak about more Man United. Hey, hey. Back to midweek football again. So. Let me, let me, I haven't even seen the midweek fixtures, but let me go through them for people that don't know it because like me, but I want to see what the best fixtures are there, innit? Newcastle yeah, it's it's might be a decent game. Depends how they park up. Um, yeah, that was a really good game last time. That's on Tuesday. Oh, sorry, Tuesday. oh my days. Yeah. West Ham versus Tottenham on a Tuesday. Yeah, that's the 8.15 kick hey, Tottenham on Kids, the, How do you know I, that, you sicko? Bro, I, listen, I've got to tap in, bro. I'm losing that game, you know. I said losing. Wait, 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 wait. Hit, wait, wait. Hey, you have Chelsea at the bridge, bro. Why are you wait, 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 wait. Months, 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 months. What are we doing here? I said Chelsea. Anyways, let's let's keep it Let's keep it a buck here. Let's keep it a buck. Burnley just went there with 10 men. Stop. That's, not yeah, that's... It. Listen, yeah, that was Binky. That was Bing. That was yeah. bongy. That was hell. Anyways, bongy. let me let me say this year. So that's on a Thursday as well. But Man City's got Aston Villa, West Ham's got Tottenham, and all of a sudden we beat Chelsea. That's what I said. Different conversations, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah, you see it, kid. And yeah, they got Luton Town at home, and while you got Sheffield United, I'm just saying isn't it. Someone has to drop points, and it won't be me this time. It's going to be one of you or both of you. And then guess what? I'm five points behind or whatever it is with a nice game in hand against Sheffield, against Villa. Cute times. Wait, is it actually... Wait, who? when is Liverpool playing Sheffield? Uh, Thursday as well. Thursday. It's, it's, 45, it's 45 minutes before. And, and guess what? They're going to absolutely annihilate them. Bro, I... Oh, fam, Liverpool. <laughs> I don't even want to bother asking for Sheffield to do something, bro. I don't even want to just forget it. Let me just forget that game as a whole because that's just... Bro... I'm asking ah, for yeah. a I'll be I love real. this. I love this, man. I love this. Do you think is there, no, is there could be a way Sheffield can get something? Is there? I don't okay, know. Who? Whom? Whom? Diaz. Oh, I'm just trying to think. 
Berish and Diaz and McBurney combo, bro. I'm dead. Hey, there's four I'm jokes in Luton Town getting signed at Arsenal and Sheffield at Anfield. That's a fact. <laughs> No, That's fact. Fact. I'm asking for bears, I'll be real. <laughs> and all I know that Kabore at right wing back polluting is one of the most terrible defenders I've ever seen. Oh, talk yeah, him, oh, yeah, him that in that Tottenham team. Yeah, me off, yeah. Man, see, talk about your product. I thought all man city products were good. Nah, he's stiff, man. He's, he's, he's crap, man. man. Garbage, man. Oh, yeah, we need to speak about um that Tottenham game as well. Madison, what are we saying for that, Ethan? Injured, bro. No, so no, no don't, give me, don't give me the injury thing, please. Don't give me that. You saw, you saw Wait, Saka what, today. Yeah, forget, again, I'll see you got Madison. I'm sorry, Madders. Where was he? Where yeah, was Madders, he? Madders played dusty, and I built be real because Basuma played dusty, it didn't help. He, didn't, he was by himself in the midfield. Basuma as well. Boy, listen, Tottenham are just for me. I honestly can see United pipping you. If I'm being completely nah, honest. Reason, don't reason be being, don't get sucked no, 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 no. Let me tell you why, yeah. Like I yeah. said, reason being, yeah. I generally think you are dropping points to West Ham away. I honestly think that, yeah, because they always turn up against you as well, yeah. And I can see United beating Chelsea. So as we see that, as we do the math, they're going to be six points behind you. Yeah. Yeah. Same games played. Yeah. And you got that mad, mad running, bro. Newcastle away. And, Me. and kids, this is one of them games where I have to win. I have to win before this running. I have to win this. Yeah, no, but you no, but you're not though. West Ham away, you're not winning that game. I can say that honestly. I can say that now, honestly. Right, don't get sucked into the hype. I could what? remember top five qualifies for Champions League. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. Ethan, you know that unfortunately fifth isn't going to help you out between me and you, as you know for personal reasons. <laughs> <laughs> this doesn't do anything for you, bro. You so I, I need I need United getting top four in it. That's what I need. I'll be real. If we've gone from title challenges to top four, that's a failure of a season, isn't it? Although I've sold Kane on that. Wait, so what? What did you just say? Yeah, bro. You just certain said to certain Tottenham fan, f certain people amongst my Tom fan base thought we were going to challenge for a title. Oh, like if we go from yourself included. No, not myself. If we go from the expectation to around Christmas to now, the, the levels just dropped off significantly. Yeah, no, I'll be real. You're not you're not beating Hammers away, bro. I, I ain't no, gonna lie. Why not, bro? Man, them struggle against Newcastle, Newcastle entire back line plus their reserve back line. Yeah, but what I'm saying, they, now they need to, they're gonna be at home. Fans are gonna be up for it. Bro, you can't sit there and tell me that every game you play versus West Ham, that they don't turn up. They turn they up do, every game. Bro. That's their that's their man's fan. Literally. Lidge. They take it mad yeah, serious. Someone, well, that's someone will never die. If someone will never die when Ethan said, man feared me. Oh yeah, man feared me. <laughs> if someone will never die. But listen, you lot. Listen, you lot. Um, See the thing about we're YouTube. Gonna end, we're going to end it there, man. Big up everyone in the chat. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel. I've, I haven't checked how many subscribers we're on, but uh, we are well on the way to um, 8,900. So if you haven't subscribed already, please get that done. Um, if you haven't liked the video already, please get that done. Obviously, um, I'll leave two links in the chat to, so you guys can obviously watch the shorter version of my match reaction for the Arsenal and Liverpool games also. So just have a look at the video section and you'll catch those there as well. Um, and of course, we'll be back tomorrow, tomorrow evening. We're going to be on Never FI a little bit later. As well, Cass, what time are we going live later? Just so 11, 11. Guna Lee. Yeah. Martin, basically kind of same vibe that they owe. Deji's going to be on it. Deji's going to have a thing or two to say. Yeah, fun times. Good stuff. So, yeah, some more um, some more content to be, you know. And to then be... tomorrow, tomorrow, who we got on tomorrow, man? We got Dawood on tomorrow. We should have Brands on. <laughs> George, it should be a funny panel as well. It's going to be a fun show. It's going to be a fun show. So, guys, make sure you guys tune in. Um, either way, guys, big you up, big up everyone in the chat, everyone who sent in their super chats as well. Big up all the members. I believe there's about 60 something members, so big up all the members as well. Um, and guys, one set, big up Marcus, big Marcus knows, did it? Big you up, yes, so everything um, stay, stay on this stream and um, head over to Troops TV. Where obviously, him, the Sam, uh, Flawless, and Lewis are. Make sure you subscribe over there, get Troops to 300k. And subscribe to their respective channels as well man just make sure when you go to over to that channel type in bsb raid so yeah man make sure you guys do that big up assad you know what i'm saying every time marcus bud king books and all the gang them there's too many of you like mr link right tell all you guys in it you know i've gone in today take care guys and we'll see you in the next one top of the league.